We were first up the wishing well. I'm telling you, we ran. And then like, it's awesome. We got to see it with yeah. nobody here. <laughs> awesome. In the shadowy woodlands of central Portugal, there's a fascinating and mysterious destination known as Quinta da Regalera. This site is renowned for its magnificent palace, constructed in 1904 by Antonio Montiero, who had a deep interest in the Freemasons and the occult. The estate is adorned with symbols linked to the Knights of Templar and the Masonic lore. Among its most intriguing features is the initiation well that extends 30 meters deep or 90 feet into the earth. It is believed that this inverted tower was the initiation path for Templar Masons who had to overcome dark to reach the light. Sintra is located 30 minutes from Lisbon, Portugal and is a popular day trip from the city. We spent two days in Sintra exploring its fascinating castles and palaces. While Peña Palace and the Moorish Castle are the most popular places to visit, Quinta da Regalira was a highlight for us and did not disappoint. So we made it here to Quinta da Regalera here in Sintra and uh, it's actually a beautiful park but obviously the highlight is the initiation well. We got our tickets ahead of time online and arrived early to the main gate where the ticket holders go and got right to the front. So make sure you do that. As soon as the gate opens, you want to go ahead of the crowd as fast as you can. Don't meander. Be first to scan your ticket and then just run to the well. <laughs> Seriously. Or walk really fast. The good thing is, is they do have uh, a lot of signs just pointing where to get to the well. So you don't have to wander and wonder. Uh, there, it's good signage. Yeah, so we got in very first. It gave us time to actually take in the view, take some photos, do some selfies. It was fantastic. So we were in there for probably about two minutes to ourselves, I'd say. I'd say, yeah. Yeah, until the groups kind of came in and guides started saying, move along, move along. <laughs> <laughs> so, but it was great. It was nice to see. I would definitely recommend getting your tickets beforehand. Uh, unlike uh, Pena Palace, uh, there is no timed entry here, so uh, it opens at 10 o'clock in the morning. So getting here around, we arrived about, I would say, 9.15, and there was already a lineup. So uh, yeah, get here early. If you roll in around quarter to 10, you're going to be standing in a big line just to get in through the gate, even if you have your tickets. Quinta de Regaliera is open from 10 a.m. and crowds form early. We walked from our hotel in the city center, Casa Holstein, that was about a 20-minute walk uphill. We arrived almost an hour early and it was perfect timing as we were at almost the front of the crowds. We got our tickets through Get Your Guide and all it was was a voucher and then you want to make sure that you have WhatsApp. That's a really important thing. When we're traveling, we also use a virtual SIM called Aerolo. Uh, we'll put that in all of the links below. So we emailed or messaged our guide uh, for the WhatsApp that would give us our voucher and all he did was sent us our ticket and uh, gave us instructions for everything of what to do and that worked out perfectly so we didn't have to go meet him at the meeting point. With our prepaid tickets in hand, we didn't hesitate once the gates open and walked directly to the initiation well to view it without the crowds. Entrance to the well is included with the fee to the park. There are nine levels with exactly 15 steps each, echoing the nine circles of hell from Dante's Inferno. Visiting the well is a bit of a frenzy as the crowds form quickly, but we were first in and gave ourselves a bit of breathing room before the crowds formed behind us. The walk down the 135 steps moves quickly as crowds push you along and tour guides tell you to keep moving, but it is fascinating to stop and look up. The stairs are very narrow and when you stop, people will continue to walk by and bump into you. Most are annoyed with any stops on the stairs, so it's just an assembly line of needing to keep going. Luckily, we were nice and early, so we had a bit of time to spare. Hi there! 
Pretty amazing. It gets darker and darker as you go deep into the ground, and I can only imagine what the Freemasons must have felt when they were doing their initiation. This is a masterpiece and a feat of engineering. There are symbols carved into the walls that are linked to the Knights of Templar and the Order of Christ. Each symbol tells a part of a story and is a piece of a puzzle from medieval times. Make sure to examine the star compass at the bottom with the Templar cross at its center, representing the eight knights and the Grand Master. And then after you come through there, you actually can look at a couple other small caves, uh, as well as there's a nice little waterfall you can take a photo of. Uh, and actually the caverns weaving through there are pretty cool as well. All right, it has barely opened and it's already getting busy in here. So I highly recommend rushing right to the well. The tours have started. The caves are already filling up. And uh, it's neat to see though, it's very cool. As long as you're first. It's like anywhere nowadays, you have to be first. We were last at Pena Palace because we heard that was a good idea, but I think probably first was better. The secretive passages and the network of tunnels are said to hold Masonic secrets and they connect different parts of the estate. The caves are quite tight in places and there isn't a lot of signage, but you'll be able to find your way out eventually. So just relax and enjoy the maze. It's a very cool experience to contemplate the rituals that once took place in these secretive tunnels. Then once you're done the initiation well, you can walk down and meander your way through the pass down to the palace and take a look and spend as much time as you like here in the gardens. It's a nice cool place to spend some time as well as it does get pretty hot here. Thanks for exploring the initiation well with us. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more adventures. Until next time, keep exploring the mysteries around you. That's it. Ha, 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 ha.